After a week of downing tools, the hammer has fallen as regards the fate of our thousand striking health workers in Busia County. A crisis meeting of the county executive committee on Sunday resolved to sack the workers. We are going to start on a clean slate. We are going to start recruiting our medical personnel afresh. So ours is to tell our brothers and sisters who have deserted duty, goodbye. Governor says Peter Odamong making good his threat after the workers defied orders to resume duty. Consequently, all retirees and unemployed but trained medical personnel are being encouraged to submit job applications to the Chief Officer, Health and Sanitation starting on Monday, 24 November 2015. Odamong says no immediate former member of staff will be allowed to apply. We call upon all the retired personnel, qualified personnel who are jobless so far, from today to submit their papers to the chief officer, health. And immediately they submit their papers, we are going to deploy them as they come to our various facilities so that they can start discharging duties. Since the strike began on Monday last week, three patients have died and avert to such incidents, Ojamong said they will partner with private health institutions until new staff are recruited. Kenya National Union of Nurses Chairman Isaiah Omondi dismissed the governor's move. Kenya National Union of Nurses and Kenya Medical Practitioners and Dentist Union had complained of delays in payment of salaries, lack of promotions as well as inadequate supply of drugs. Mukami Bogwa reporting for Tanawan News.